In version 9.1, PC Crash gives you additional vehicle-specific impact parameters. In this example, I have a vehicle braking into impact with a stopped semi-trailer. One contact is uh, calculated with automatic collision detection, but looking in the 3D view, you can see that that contact plane there is vertical. And in this case, because the nose is diving and there's probably some kind of underride going on, it might be more appropriate to have an inclined contact plane. Now you can model this uh, yourself, but if you have multiple impacts going on with different things, it'd be nice to have uh, the tied to the vehicle. So two additions that have been made to 9.1 include our impact parameters, pick the semi-trailer, the constant point of impact height, so I'm going to make the point of impact height a little higher to reflect that it's hitting the roof. I'm going to turn on a constant friction there, and I'm going to incline the contact plane angle. So that's rotating the contact plane about the horizontal axis. Uh, there's other options including contact plane angle in the uh, top-down direction and also the restitution, which can be applied on a per-object basis. So now when I run this, you can see there are multiple crashes calculated. And when I look in the 3D view, these contacts all have an inclined contact plane, which pushes the nose of the vehicle down. resulting in more of that underride contact and a longer uh, distribute or a, a longer uh, total contact time.